years ago, I got caught up in the 12, 13, 14 dimensions. I read some about string theory and the like, and they talked there may be 10, 15, 12 dimensions. And I started to wonder, this didn't happen over one day. This just started bothering me. Uh, what would this peach look like in a 10 dimensional world, a five dimension? Well, if you blew this up, took this apart, if this disintegrated into this five, 10 dimensions, where would the taste go? Where would its texture go? How would you describe its weight? If each of these are in a different dimension. And I started adding them up. And they all came out to about 12. I can't figure them all out right now. I had them down on paper. You have your height your width, your depth, and it exists in time. This peach also has a volume. It is a concept also as height, width, and depth. In our three, four-dimensional world, you have height, you cannot have height without a width can't have those without a depth, unless it's extremely thin and it, you, you just see right through it. So those are concepts, height, width, depth, and time, but it also has a volume, which you cannot have without a height, width, depth. These can be measured with the eyes, of course, and put down on paper. It also has color. It has a shape, be it round, square, triangular. It has a sound. This is a concept also, as the shape is. It has weight. That's a concept. Depending on which planet you live on, the uh, weight can be measured with proper instruments. It has a taste. This is also a concept. It is something totally unique as all the rest of them. One is not related to the other. It has a texture. Get rough, soft, fuzzy. I have described 11 items or 11, uh, 11 ways of describing this peach. I can't think of the 12th. Head right, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11. I say this peach exists in 11 dimensions or 12, 13. There may be wormholes out there. There may be 14. I don't know. Things just don't add up when they talk about 12 dimensions and have no way other than mathematical computerized generations to describe things. They can't prove there's 12. But I can prove there's 12 different things about this peach. It can be measured one way or another. This little bottle of banaca. Wow. Took me back 20 years. Perhaps memory is another dimension. I say we live in a 12 dimensional world, perhaps 13, perhaps 14. All around us.
think about it. I'm sure you will. From all concepts, we can all be measured one way or another. We have the senses to do it. I thank you. I would also like to mention that though they cannot, I mean they who are making the rules, this is their idea of concepts of height, width, and depth. Just because it cannot be put down on paper with a mathematical formula after it does not mean it does not exist. It has weight. It has a color. It has a taste. It has volume, it has a shape, a sound, it has a texture. Not all of these, especially the taste, can be put into a mathematical formula, which does not mean it does not belong in a dimension. I thank you again.